Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the symptoms of a seized engine. Although it's tucked away beneath the hood of your car, the engine is the primary part that determines the efficiency and functionality of your car. It converts heat energy from burning fuel into mechanical energy. That turns the wheels of your car and enables you to drive to your destination. When your car has a seized engine, it means that the engine is locked into place due to inadequate lubrication or overheating, preventing your car from starting. So, what are the dangers of a seized engine? High cost of repair. A seized engine can cause a huge dent in your income or savings because the cost of repair is significantly expensive. Cumulative internal damage. Engine seizure causes engine parts to misalign and lodge into or grind against other parts, leading to further internal damage. Now, what are the common symptoms to look out for? Loud clunking or knocking noises. This happens when there's friction between the piston rod and the crankshaft due to inadequate lubrication. Lack of response when you try to start your car. Since the engine is locked into place, you won't be able to start your car. You'll, however, be able to turn on the radio, lights, and other electronics. Fumes or smoke coming out of the hood of your car due to the wires overheating. In severe cases, it could lead to a fire. Flashing dashboard lights. The check engine or check oil lights will flash to warn you of low oil levels or an overheating engine. To sum up, here's a quick tip on how to fix the issue. If you notice any of these symptoms, take your car to a mechanic for a professional diagnosis. Based on how severe the engine seizure is, you can decide to repair it or have it replaced. Be keen to maintain healthy oil levels in your engine and take your car for regular maintenance. Thanks for watching.